Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Hey, hey, wake up. Finally. Don't worry where you are right now. All you need to know is you're under my... And I know who you are. No, enough with the formalities. Where did you hide them? Don't play dumb with me. I know exactly what you're up to. And you can't use your quirk either because I'm stopping you from it. Now tell me, where did you hide them? You're not gonna talk, huh? That's fine. We can just keep you here, then. Keep you under lock and key in a cell. 24-hour surveillance. How does that sound to you? You don't like that. Well, too bad. For your villains, I suggest that you talk now. Otherwise, we're just going to capture everyone else and interrogate them until they speak. Like I'm doing here with you. Now, I don't want to hurt you, and obviously you want to hurt me. We could do this quite the easiest way possible. Just tell me. Where are they? You think this is a matter of... Fine. Continue speaking. <laughs> That's enough. I'm not going to have you talk down about our heroes. Now... Are you going to tell me something useful, or am I going to actually use physical force to tell you where... <sighs> you're right. Although you're a villain, a dirty crook at that, I still have to treat you like a human being, otherwise I'm not going to get anything out of you. Your own words, I will follow them. But I'm still not going to stop letting in on you until you tell me everything. Your boss is nothing but a downright criminal. Killing hundreds of people, stealing from our banks, blowing up buildings with no care, or even cares about the people who are inside those buildings. Your boss is a monster. And I have no time to play games with you. You see this? Yes, it's a handgun. Which you shot at one of my partners. And it stopped his quirk. What was these bullets made out of? Talk. You're lucky my partner here is helping me keep my eyes open and rehydrated. Otherwise, you would have gone wild and started using your quirk here. Which is something we don't need. Now, can you tell me exactly where do you get this gun? Now you're not talking again. Fine. 
I didn't have to have to come to this, but... If you're not going to tell me, I'm going to shoot you where you sit. I'm not playing games with you. These are innocent lives that you're just playing around with like it's some toys. Am I bluffing? Now tell me, where are my students? Where are you hiding them? I'm going to give you the count of five. If you don't tell me where my students are and promise that they're safe, I'm going to put one of these bullets into one of your kneecaps. And trust me, they're not the quirk-stopping bullets. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. See. Wasn't that easier. Mike. We got the information. The students are in a warehouse. Just outside of the city. Get at least four heroes with you. I don't think they're going to be alone. Copy. Now, if you'd done that sooner, I wouldn't have to do that. You do know that, right? Thank you for the information. I'm leaving now. Hmm? Why are you laughing? What's so funny? You bastard! How dare you put my students' lives in harm's way! I should kill you where you stand. He's right. I can't, I can't be talking talk like this, this, especially in a place where there are security cameras everywhere. I'm supposed, I'm supposed to be, to be a, hero, a hero, but I'm acting like a villain. You won't have any effect on me. I'm a racer head. A pro hero. Nothing more and nothing less. I'm here to protect those who can't protect themselves. And my students are my top priority to make sure they're safe. We'll see about that. Mike, there might be more people coming. Bring more heroes with you. Bring Gran Turismo with you as well. You're going to need to speed. Copy. You're a sick human being. You should be here. And every time I come here and I see you... I'm going to wish every single time that you rot inside that cell for putting my students in harm's way. You should be. One more thing. If you don't mind me asking, you said there was a type of a device hiding in that warehouse with my students. What kind of device is it? <laughs> I'm not playing with you. Tell me what the device is. Time machine. Now 
haven't really heard of a time machine before. Is that even possible? Scientist. <laughs> All right. I'm leaving for real this time. Hope your life in jail goes perfect. Mike, I'm on my way. <laughs>